Well, take a look at this. Boy, it's nothing but sunshine and blue sky out there today. The last time we had a day with 100% sunshine was way back on January 21st. Today's the warmest day since April 24th, and what's interesting about that is that today is still one degree cooler than average for this time of year. And May 1 to 7 was about three and a half degrees cooler than average here, continuing a trend we've had all through this year, the uh, year 2022, averaging about two degrees cooler than average here in Grand Rapids. Well, here's Boatworks, the restaurant over in the Holland area. Boy, what a beautiful day. A lot of people there uh, enjoying uh, dinner and looking out over the lake. Uh, we've had boats going by today. The blossoms looking absolutely gorgeous in the Holland area. Tulips will be out this week. They time tulip uh, time just uh, absolutely perfectly. Nothing much on Storm Track Live. We got some heavy thunderstorms uh, out there and a watch just issued for parts of South Dakota and Nebraska, but we will stay dry here in West Michigan. Some showers behind me there over toward New York and the East Coast. We'll stay clear tonight. There'll be a crescent moon off to the west, partly sunny skies for tomorrow afternoon, so not quite as sunny as today, but we'll take it. And boy, a warm week coming up, warmest week we've had here since last summer. Our uh, future cast shows nothing but clear skies here overnight tonight. We start to pick up some clouds during the day tomorrow. These are just high clouds. The sun will be shining through those, no rain to worry about. And then we're back into the sunshine here for the day on Tuesday. So that's looking pretty good. These are low temperatures overnight tonight. We stop at about 41 in Grand Rapids. We're going to see a big swing between daytime highs and nighttime lows. Big Rapids down to 35. I would not be surprised if places that are cold uh, like uh, the Baldwin area could reach uh, 32 by early tomorrow morning. Could even be a scattering of frost. But for most areas, the wind holds up and the air is just so dry that we're not going to be seeing a... Uh, uh, any frost across most of the area. These are high temperatures for tomorrow. Uh, look for readings in all areas up around 66 to 69. Uh, right at the lakeshore, it ought to be just as warm as inland areas here. Uh, Grand Rapids, you're up to 69 tomorrow afternoon. Grand Haven, just a slight lake breeze if you're on the beach, 64 the high tomorrow. And same thing in the southern counties. We're seeing that today, and uh, this uh, computer model forecasts this very well, 60 Eight for Kalamazoo, 62 for South Haven, a little cooler at Benton Harbor as well. How about this for an eight-day forecast? Wowie zowie, 68 degrees here tomorrow. For a great day for Mother's Day. We're up to 77 on Monday, and a rather breezy day. It'll be, again, just as warm at the lakeshore as it will be in inland areas. We're up to the low 80s here Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. The chance of rain, not zero, but it's pretty small, about a 30% chance of a shower, thunder shower Wednesday, 20% on Thursday. So I uh, think summer, really warm air shaping up here for much of this coming week. Definitely. We've been begging for spring to finally peek through the clouds and it looks like summer has kicked through instead. Yeah, we'll that's right. It. And that's uh, going to stick around here for eight to 10 days. All right. Thanks, Bill.